Hello everyone. So I'm just coming to share something with you. A uh, few weeks back I just saw in my dream how the war was in heaven and how the devil rebelled against God and he, his angels rebelled with him too. And how God was very patient with them and how uh, the Lord st stood up and the devil was cast out. But then he went to fight the believers. I saw he used a, uh, a spear. He threw a spear toward me. And he was chasing me. And I was climbing this mountain very fast. So it was like a picture, if you can picture how Saul was trying to kill David, you know, and how he had this haze toward David. So that's how they, uh, the devil was chasing me. I was climbing this mountain and there was uh, this compound I climbed upon and I fell down in. And there were like a park, very nice park. That's w when he, uh, he, um, he stopped chasing me. In this park, I saw uh, a bride and a bridegroom, and I knew in my heart that that was God and his bridegroom, I mean his bride, you know. <clears throat> so that's how the, tr the dream went. Believers, this period of time we are living in, and according to how God described this period in the Bible, and according to what God is keeping showing us, and according to how I believe in my heart, what the Spirit is telling me, we are living in the fulfillment time. We are not living no longer in the time of prophecies, in the time of, you know, Jesus is coming a few years, you know, from now. Jesus, you know, I don't know. What I believe is this. <clears throat> we are in the time of fulfillment. And the Lord he will fulfill the promises he made to his saints. Remember God is speaking in the Bible. He's saying, you know, <clears throat> look after the kingdom of heaven first. Search the kingdom of heaven and other things will be added to you. And when it comes to prophecies, the things of life, cause you know marriage promotion travel career whatever you know even ministry comes as things of this earth they are added but the things of the kingdom is the things that is of eternal life and when it comes to fulfillment, when we say God will fulfill things, this is the period of fulfillment. God is going to fulfill that big promise. Is the promise of Jesus Christ, of the coming of the Lord. Is the promise of us going into everlasting life, into glory. And this is a time, I'm telling you people of God, this is a time God will fulfill what he promised. I, I saw things a few days back and they came to fulfillment. People going home to heaven. I saw things. My wife saw things. Christians are, th are seeing things. And the Holy Spirit is telling us we are going to see the fulfillment of the promise of God. And I'm not talking you having a car, or you having a job, or you traveling somewhere else, seeing the stuff, or just normal kind of things of life. We are going back home. May God bless you. May God give you, give, give you hope. May God um, help you not to feel alone. Because the Lord is here. God bless you all. And the grace of God, the grace of our great, almighty God be with you all. In Jesus' name, amen.